Before we start the next uh, the next bit, I'm going to walk into the kitchen. I'm going to open up my fridge, and I am going to pull out a freaking Zima. A Zima. A Zima, a refreshing citrus beverage. I took a drink of one of these last night, and I was like, oh, my God. Oh, my God. This is so weird. <laughs> Bella stopped watching, but she was watching and just looked at me, and she said, what? And I... And I tried to come up with a way to explain Zima, and the way that I did is imagine if Sprite decided to make alcohol. <laughs> Am I saying that would taste great? No, but it would be drinkable. This is a drinkable beverage. I'm not saying it's great. I'm not saying it's horrible, but it's definitely drinkable. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Well, I... I Basically, I'm a sucker for anything retro right now. It, it, the, the way that I am with Zima is the same way I was with Crystal Pepsi. It, it, I'm a sucker for shit like this. <laughs> a freaking sucker for this. Oh my god, I can't believe Zima came to that. Like, yeah, okay. Uh, <laughs> drinking the Zima, right? <clears throat> oh my god, this tastes weird. God, this stuff really... Ah, it's weird. You expect it to taste like beer, but then it tastes like a like a slutty Seven Up. <laughs> it tastes slutty like slutty Seven Up. Yeah, yeah. It tastes like a like a Capri Sun prostitute. It's been a while because I think I've only drank one in my life when they like first came out. It was kind of like from my memory, like Kool-Aid or Pez. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's a weird, it's a weird taste. And it didn't, it didn't taste like you were drinking a drink. Yeah. Every time that I drank it, back in the day, I would always get made fun of because, oh, you're drinking Zima? That's a girl drink. <laughs> That's a, that's a chick drink. Why are you drinking a chick drink? It's like, I don't care. I just like the way this tastes. This tastes great. It doesn't taste like a freaking beer. All we have all we have at my place is a Tecate, and that tastes like Mexican battery acid. This tastes like something good. I'm going to drink this Zima. <laughs> whenever, whenever we would go out to any place where we might have a couple of drinks, I always request the girl drinks. Yeah, they they like, taste what kind so of girl good. drinks that you have. Yeah. And and there's more alcohol in those those drinks. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Uh -huh. You get this big like you get this big like a uh, goldfish bowl of a glass. Mhm. Mm it's like huge and it's got little umbrellas in it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Love a girl drink. Then I can and sit there, I could sit there. Enjoy my drink and kind of look at people and be like, You're not going to laugh at me about my glass, are you? You're not going to do it. <laughs> yeah. Love Zima. Love Zima so much. Honey, do you want a drink of my Zima? Yeah. Yeah, here. <laughs> Zima was never your thing, though, was it? How would you know? I was like, What? 12? Why do you? Why must you hurt me like that, honey? Why must you hurt me? Uh, and on the show too, I the way I just described Zima, it's a slutty Capri Sun. It's a Kool Aid prostitute. It's like if Sprite decided to make alcohol. <laughs> it's a Seven Up malt beverage. Love this stuff. Anyway, Zima. Zima, guys. Zima exists. Zima. It's probably at your local Walmart. Just FYI. 